All right, Project Zomboid, let's dive right into this. So I was streaming this the other day and some folks were asking about my controller uh, controller profile. So um, I was playing a little bit more, polished it up. I actually, it's kind of a twofold thing. I want to get this config out there, but also just so I can get back to playing the game because I had to put it into debug mode just so I could test out controls. Um, so right away, I'm using GamePad. The, in, the Build 41 has pretty good controller support, so I'm just using all the baked-in stuff. Like, you get these radials for your uh, weapons. Right pad is right stick. Because the, the mouse combat feels kind of weird so and vehicle controls felt really clunky with mouse and keyboard they feel freaking amazing with the controller because you have analog throttle and steering but what you're probably asking is oh how's that inventory management so fully with the controller like it's just a for options x to move it Left and right to go over, so X to take it back, X to take it back, left bumper cycles your local things, right bumper cycles your, uh, let's uh, show that a little bit better. There, so right bumper cycles between lootables over here left bumper your inventory now i made a modification to this you can hold right bumper and then down or up cycles the right side like right bumper for the right side left bumper hold and cycle over here so that was, that was just a personal little tweak. Now, if you're struggling with this and you still want to use the mouse, well, you can. You hold the... You click left grip to toggle, which I just heard a little beep. Left grip toggles it off, or hold, and that gives you a mouse layer. Now, the issue, like this, see? It's like, oh, it won't let me grab those. So if you're having that issue, you know, I pushed y, pushed y to open my inventory. Close my inventory, go into this mouse layer, then open your inventory. Then I can click and drag, select multiple, drag them over. That's just seems to be a little limitation with how the game handles mouse and gamepad inputs. Left stick click will be gyro steering. We'll go over that in a second. Right pad click has some D-pad clicks. Middle is activate. Left pad is for your weapons. So yeah, let's go over that. So I click up and down. You can just do it once if you want. And to be able to click this without activating the aim, that's why I have this as joystick camera if you're wondering like you can touch anywhere on the pad and it won't move until it won't activate it's, it's kind of like a cell phone type emulation which is useful sometimes and feels pretty good here so this was just a shortcut to your inventory right for right now it's just right stick click I'm not sure what function that serves in the game yet, but I wanted to keep it in there. Yeah, like, middle for open. And that's something, too, with that mouse layer. You can click in there and hold. And, well, I guess you can't do it on the door. I know you can do it on certain things. Or not. I don't, I don't know. I guess it's being kind of buggy. Usually I can click. So, clearly, there's still some some fussiness when you're mixing inputs but like i'm saying i honestly am not using that mouse layer very much i mainly just use it to like check 
up here or maybe something in the menu or like to open up this debug while I'm testing stuff out. So just to show like the normal process would be X to interact, device options, and then it's showing you these new controller prompts. And also if you're noticing that those look different than yours, I made a mod on the workshop just to change the controller glyphs. I'll, I'll have a link to that in the description. Um, so like here, I can move it around. RB to select inner. Then I can use the stick, turn it on. Anyways, that's... Um, but what I wanted to go over was... The reason I put this left stick left is your uh, weapon radial. The reason I put that on left pad is so you can be like... running away and switch. And then trip over a fence. Right trigger is run. B is sprint, but I'm too heavy to do that. Uh, I think that's... I mean, that's pretty much it. I think the only thing I don't really have in this would be VoIP. Which, I mean, I do people actually use that? You could... I mean, it could figure out a place to put it. Just trigger. We'll start it. Um, so here, I click left left stick click now I have gyros woohoo it, it feels much smoother than mouse and keyboard steering I mean the gyro is maybe a little like whoa little unruly but I still I wanted that in there um how do I Trying to remember how I turn it off. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, that's an example. I can just switch to my mouse layer and click on this stuff if I need to. Let's lock the doors. Oh, just a single click on uh, left pad is sneak. Long is that radial menu. And then this mouse layer is ripe you know, for some extra things that might need added. Just remember if you're having difficulties clicking and dragging, exit the mouse layer, close your inventory, go back into the mouse layer, open the inventory with the I button. All right, so do I want to try to fight these guys off? I think I'm in God mode. I don't think it even matters. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just to give you a taste, to show you that the... So that'd be a good example, that's why I did that, so I could... Like, oh no! Walk away and then switch. Oh yeah, left trigger, default, is a uh, push. Yeah, I think, I think that's it. So how do I turn the vehicle off with a controller? There has to be some way that you do it. Hmm. Oh. Duh. Yeah, that's, um... Up. <laughs> up on the stick. It's your vehicle options. So, now that this controller config is done, I'm gonna take it off de debug mode and get back to normal dying. So, all right, I will see you around. Something different for a change? Then try the perfect refreshment. Chili Dilly, a delicious pickle treat that's spiced just right for every bite. Economical, too. There's no waste. You eat every bit of the juicy goodness of Chili Dilly. How about trying one right now? Chili Dilly, on sale at our concession stand. You'll love them.